we are the ones who are going to make a change. And you are thinking that, you know, you're just one person and your contribution wouldn't make a bigger change, then this, then nobody will be there to make a change. Hi, I am Hassan Mustafa Zaidi, and I am a Global U Grad alumnus from 2011. And currently, I am working as the founder and executive director of Discovering New Artists. And I'm also acting as a consultant to Queen's Commonwealth Trust, where I manage a network of more than 850 plus young leaders across the Commonwealth. I was really excited when I heard this news that you know I was being selected for the Global U Grad program at Humboldt State University in Arcata, California. The mere idea of going to California seemed really, you know, fantastic to me. I was a student of economics and I had to take economics as a mandatory course, but I opted for those courses which I thought that, you know, I would not experience here at FC College or even in Pakistan uh, while I was studying economics. So I opted for woodworking, I opted for beginning piano, I opted for singing, and I opted for fencing. I started discovering new artists back in 2011 when I returned from the US, from the UGRAD program. We started with just 30 students and we had 30 volunteers from our college and that made me really proud that I was successful in getting these young people to these kind of community service. We started Art for Change under Discovering New Artists in 2014. That made me win this Queen's Young Leaders Award in 2018 and that was a really once in a lifetime experience going to Her Majesty the Queen and receiving the award from her at Buckingham Palace. I think one of the proudest moments that I had there was representing my country Pakistan at such an international stage. We invite private school students to participate in Art for Change with the fee that they submit for participation. We use that fee to buy art materials and then we uh, give it out to uh, marginalized students for free of cost and we don't charge anything to them uh, to, you know, to participate in, uh, on the platform. When we sell these art uh, artworks in the exhibitions, all the proceeds that we generate go towards sponsoring the education of these marginalized students. Uh, up till now we have uh, reached out to 1,23,000 students so far in the past eight years and now Art for Change has become international and we have been receiving artworks from not just from all the cities from Pakistan but 15 different countries. You can't work in an isolated environment in this era when it's a global village. So I truly believe that US-Pakistan relations have been really better from past you know a lot of years and especially in terms of education sector you look at Global UGRAD program or Fulbright program these programs have actually enabled hundreds of our, you know, scholars, um, youngsters to go abroad and experience with different outlooks and to get exposure from different professors' experiences. So I believe that, you know, these relations need to be a little bit more stronger in coming years. And that's what I hope to bring more peace, prosperity to our country as well. Thank you.